Good morning. It's Tuesday, the 23rd of December. Good morning. Welcome to the programme. Also ahead, hospital... Our main story this morning. Police were called to deal with incidents of violence in English schools more than 7,000 times last year. The figures obtained by the Conservatives under the Freedom of Information Act. And they claim it shows schools lack sufficient powers to tackle misbehaviour. Another high street retailer, Wittards of Chelsea, is said to be on the brink of administration. The chain... Well, Simon's going to have more on that in business a little later. He's in Skipton today. He's finding out how things are on the high street. Stay with us for that. And hundreds of homeless people are being thrown a lifeline today as the charity Crisis opens nine centres offering shelter and hot meals. Louisa Baldini is at one in North... Most of us are aware that the rich food and drink that we consume at Christmas really isn't very healthy. Did you know, though, that the average turkey dinner is also extremely salty? In fact, it contains double the recommended maximum amount of salt that you should eat in an entire day, as Jane Hughes reports. There you go. In the morning's top stories. We're also discussing the cost of turkey a little later, actually. It's not all doom and gloom, promise, but it has gone up by 25%. Coming up in this hour, this will chew up. Nick Park tells us about the making of his latest Wallace and Gromit adventure. It's called A Matter of Loaf. Loaf. Loaf and, and death. death. And it's uh, brilliantly made. It and is. Wallace and Gromit are here. They're going to be joining us. Yes, live. live. <laughs> but 